Good morning, everyone. My name is Callie Hoots. I'm 25 years old, and I'm giving this speech in the honor of my Aunt Karen, who believed in me, encouraged me, taught me. She came to the very first conference in Jacksonville, Florida. She wanted to be here this year, but she passed away February the 11th. I am the Best Buddies Ambassador for the state of Texas. Last year, I graduated from a two-year certificate program at Lone Star College in Houston. I returned to Lone Star College last fall to continue my education by taking regular college classes to go into being a teacher's aide to work with children with intellectual disabilities. I first want to talk to the parents in this room. Please know that those of us with 1P36 can and do learn. We can hear you, so please talk to us all, all times. Teach us everything you see and know. When I was a kid, a therapist asked my dad what he hoped for me. He said, he just wanted me to walk and talk someday. Minnie said, I couldn't. Did, did you know that I was, what was, I was once diagnosed with failure to thrive? Are you serious? <laughs> ha! I proved them wrong on that one, too. My parents believed that I should be expo exposed to everything taught to all students in school. Hey, I can quote Shakespeare. I can talk about faces of the moon. I can explain that 1P36 is a deletion on a chromosome. I can because I heard about those things and I learned about chromosomes in science class. Read to your child. Let them hear about our world. They are listening. Be strong. Go with your gut, your heart. No one knows your child like, like you do. No one. Be an advocate. I'm an advocate for my friends, for people with 1P36 deletion syndrome, and for myself. In this room, we are all advocates. What do you call a person who has a disability? What would you call me? I am not the 1P36 girl, but you can call me Callie. Or say, hey, lady. Or you can say that woman, but shh, don't tell my dad. He still thinks I'm his little girl. So that's it. I'm a woman who, oh yeah, who has 1P36. I'm a person first who just so happens to have 1P36. I also want to talk to you about spread the word to end the R word. Retarded is a medical term, but a lot of people say it as a put down. Retarded is a medical term, but a lot of people say it as a put down. It really upsets me when I hear the R word, especially when it is said as a joke. It is wrong, and it's hurtful, and it's not nice. Did you know that a hundred years ago, idiot and moron were medical terms used to describe people with intellectual disabilities? Back then, people started using those words as insults. Those words are hurtful, and they're not nice, so they're not used anymore as medical terms. When my granny was a kid, a kid with an intellectual disability often didn't get to go to school. Some were sent to mental institutions like hospitals and nursing homes and not to be seen by society. When I was a, when I was a little kid, I witnessed other kids being disciplined by spraying them in the face with water or put alone in the box 
which was a very small closet. I was so scared that they would do those things to me. Because of our parents and grandparents, things have changed. Pe People can make things change. It is our time to make things change. Everyone wants to be treated with respect, including people with intellectual disabilities. I want to make a better world for your children and my friends, like those with Down syndrome and autism. Rosa's law, Rosa's law ended the federal government's use of the mental retardation, which means the government can't use that word anymore as a label. Now we must all work in our own communities to get state, local governments, schools, and the medical community to quit using mental retardation as a label. I'll say it again. It's wrong, it's hurtful, and it's not nice. So take the stand with me. Make the pledge that you will not use the R word, and you will spread, and you will spread the word to end the R word. I want to thank everyone for coming to my home state. Thank you, 1P36DSA, for giving us this conference. Thank you, everyone.